I'm Todd McCracken, the President and CEO of NSBA, and we're up here on Capitol Hill doing our work, but I want to take a quick break and uh, offer you some holiday greetings, and thank you for all your contributions to the work of the association. At the National Small Business Association, we've been around for almost 90 years. We were founded in 1937, and we represent tens of thousands of small companies all across this country uh, in all sectors of the economy, and we work on a consistently bipartisan basis to best uh, advocate for all small companies. This year, NSB had two really blockbuster events uh, to galvanize our uh, advocacy for the small business community. The first was a small business congress that uh, set priorities for this entire two-year period. The second was the biggest flying event we've ever had in our history, where small business owners from across the country flew into town uh, for briefings with us and then spent the day on Capitol Hill advocating for their businesses uh, and yours as well. This year, we've done our important work to educate members of Congress on the need to extend important tax benefits for the small business community. Many of you know the uh, tax benefits for pass is expiring in 2025, uh, but for big corporations, they continue in perpetuity. Basic unfairness, uh, an amazingly large number of members of Congress don't even realize that's the case. So uh, we're lining up support to get that accepted. As I hope you're aware, late last year, NSB advocated for small companies across the country by filing a lawsuit trying to dislodge the Corporate Transparency Act, which is an unconstitutional, unfair law that affects only small companies. So NSBA was the only small business group that stood up and fought for interests. Despite the, our success in 2023, we're not going to stop. 2024, we think, will be even better. We have plans for a, a, for a whole new NSBA look. Uh, uh, we'll be rebranding a new logo. Uh, but our commitment to nonpartisan advocacy for small businesses will change. We've been around since 1937. We've seen the country through the Depression, uh, Second World War, uh, and the many decades since, all kinds of economic conditions. We've continued to advocate for small companies on a proactive and bipartisan basis. That will change. So our core values are the same, but we've got to stay with the times and continue to uh, hone our uh, advocacy efforts as best we can. So we look forward to seeing you in 2024. Uh, our advocacy agenda will be more robust than ever uh, as we continue to grow and advocate for your needs. So happy holidays. See you in the new year. And thanks for being a member.